welcome to Linux Lit tutorial. I am going to explain about how to install Spiderwork in Ubuntu. Spiderwork is a cloud storage service. Using the Spiderwork, you can automatically backup your data to the cloud storage. Using the free account in Spiderwork, you can upload up to 2 GB of data to the cloud. You just need to install the Spiderwork client on your desktop or smartphone or the laptop. It will keep synchronizing the data from the local machine to the online cloud server. You can add any number of devices to the online backup account. And the transfer of data is very secure because AES and RES encryption method are used in Spiderwork. Now we can see the installation of Spiderwork. First you need to download the Spiderwork client application from the Spiderwork official site. Now open the browser and search spider oak and click the download and here you can see the spider oak one private backup now click the linux and you can select your architecture i'm using the debian 64 bit so i'm selecting the debian 64 now click save file to download the file now the package is getting downloaded this will take some time now the package is downloaded now open the terminal and change the directory to downloads and list the files now you can see the spider oak installation package to install this use the dpackage command dpackage i and spider oak the installation package now give enter now the spider oak application is installed now click the unity dash and search spider oak now select the spider oak one application now the spider oak application is opened now we need to set up the account for the spider oak now enter your email id now enter the full name now enter the password for the user now retype the password and you can enter your password in if you need and click create account now the account is created and you can see your host name of your system now click next now it is creating the device and the setup will be completed in 5 seconds. Now we can see the spider oak application is successfully installed. Now we can see the storage space is 2 GB free. Now we can select your files and you can just click save to upload the files to the cloud. Now it is currently uploading the uploading. If you want to stop the uploads you can press pause uploads. Now click backup and select the files that you need to backup. I am going to backup the desktop. Now click save. Now we can see the file is getting uploaded and you can see the activity here and you can see the upload is completed. Now I am going to upload the downloads. Now click save and here you can see the status that is it is currently uploading the files and you can see the status of the upload. It is completed 23%. Now the upload process is completed. Now we can see the backup that are stored in the cloud. The desktop downloads files are stored. Now we can see the preferences. You can see the preferences. Here you can see the general options that you can use. And in the backup, if you want don't want to backup the files larger than the specified size, you can mention here. Don't want to backup the older files, you can mention here. And if you want to exclude some file format, you can use this option. And in schedule, you can schedule your backup. It is now it is automatic and you can schedule by the time of day and in the sync it will sync the files on the backup schedule and in the network you, can, you have the system settings and the proxy settings available. You can increase your storage space by buying more space. You can click buy more space. You can see the current plan is a free trial that is 2 GB. You can increase your storage by changing the plan the spider oak one is successfully installed in ubuntu thank you for watching